Hello everyone and welcome back to Industry Giant. Now I realized last time I did this I didn't complete my game and I should have because the game only runs from 1960 to 2050 or 60. It only runs like 90 to 100 years before it just kicks you off and you can't go any further. So I figured we'll do a complete playthrough and see where it goes. Let's go to a new game. Go 100,000. We'll go more land, many trees, fluctuating, this looks fine. And against my better judgment, I will go yellow. It's terrible on the map, but oh well. And we'll add all three AIs. And we will deal with them later on, which will cause some problems in our game, but oh well. Let's start in 1960. First off, get an overview. This map's not the best, but it's alright. So instead of like last time where I avoided the lumber mills like a bad habit, um, I will actually deal with the lumber mills first. And then, when their lumber runs out, I will actually go ahead and reutilize the infrastructure that was built for the lumber for other things. It makes sense to me. It doesn't make sense to build up everything else, then use the lumber, and then now you have all this dead rail, not using it, not doing anything. Um, definitely going to use lots of trains, a few trucks. Ships maybe, and airplanes no, because airplanes just seem to um, seem to crash. They won't land. I don't know. They just bug out. And I might also try to show off the uh, quote-unquote signal system that you can build, but we'll see. So this actually looks like a decent spot to start. So I'll go ahead and set something up and I'll be right back. One thing I do need to mention is that I don't need to max out my loan right from the beginning in order to make this work. Which actually, I don't need a million dollars. Probably half a million dollars is enough. And then I'll build that. Alright, so I got that all set up. And we are making our skis. Now we do need to sell them at a higher price so that we can take advantage of the demand. The current our demand that we can supply. So, right off the bat, I can see that we're just going to need to add another train line. So, go ahead and do that. Alright, so we have that second train line going now. So that should get us a decent amount of skis. Let's see, we'll try to run it for a little while and see. We got. So we got six per month right now. Eighteen per month. And let's see. I don't know if it'll do another one. I really wish the date had days, that's really stupid. Probably gonna need another one. So we will do that. Alright, so new platform, new platform. Crap, it's too close. Too close to this platform. Should have known that beforehand. Um, so much we can do. Well, basically, this production is maxed out, so we'll find something else. All right, so we found a good spot for a toy store. So we can just put our toy factory down. Let's see. Toy factory needs to be in here. Which I don't 
can't get through it there. Can I fit it there? I don't know. No. Just barely won't fit there. So, I think what I have to do is put it right here. Yep, just barely. Alright, so let's do wood toys. Set our price 25% higher. And we'll do one of these. Wood here. Toys there. And it won't load the wood. Oh, I gotta load from that side. My bad. Go. No. Skip orders. There's no way to skip. Ugh. This game. I don't know why I think so highly of this game when it's so broken. Like that doesn't ugh, it doesn't even work. I don't know why this was my favorite game for so long when it's just so bad. Well, that works. But it's probably gonna produce like way more toys than we need. And it looks like Green's building a cluster fuck. Yeah, there's way too many. So we're gonna have to cut this down. Which sucks. Oh well. Anyway, we'll find something else to build and we'll be back. Alright, so I just figured out that I can just make some. What's it called? Tricycles right here. So we'll just do that. Just build some rails. Build another factory. Hopefully it'll be within range. Yep. So we'll build another twin factory for tricycles. And we'll just set up probably a four. So full. Oh, damn! Just like that. We're in like Flynn. Alright. Now, can we get plastic in the same thing? I don't think so. Hmm. So I think some of the some of the goals for this game are going to be take over everyone. Demolish their crap because it's useless and not built correctly, and repurpose it for my own. I want to build a warehouse that has one of everything, and I want to definitely use all the industries on the map. And I don't know what else. What else is there to do in this game? <laughs> I don't know. All right, we're delivering way too many tricycles, so we have to cut that down a bit. Number one thing in this game is when you want to try to make money, is you want to make sure 
that her inventories are not being overproduced. Oh, I actually do have plastic sitting right here. Holy crap. Wow. I didn't realize how good this spot really was. I said we're out of range, though. I don't know if we do this. Oh, what do you know? Wow, this is like the best place I've ever developed. You just build a doll factory right here. New platform, new platform, rails. Would you look at that? Wow. I have never gotten a, a three a, a proxy factory three oh no, that's the problem though. The factory's in the wrong spot. It's not close enough to be within range of this. Plastic. I think I could demolish all this and kind of, you know. Right, I gotta rectify this quickly. So I actually can't get plastic there. I should be able to actually do this. Plastic like that, toys, dolls like this. And it actually worked out. We got a triple proxy build. That's crazy. Never in the history of this game have I done that. Awesome. Oh, commercials. That's a good idea. I guess because I have so many different products, commercials actually will be worth it. Let's see here, I made $1.7 million last year. And let's see, most of it went to new buildings and stuff. I'll probably pay off a little bit of my loan. And we'll go from there. All right, and it looks like we've got a pretty good start on this. So I think I'll call that the end of the episode. So here's a nice overview of the map so far, and all the garbage we're going to have to pull out as soon as we take over those companies. There's our financial